and we're talking about dead birds washing up on Massachusetts beaches. No reports of that today here at Scusset Beach, but I will tell you that a new strain of avian flu is affecting wild bird populations all over the world, and that includes right here at home. Hundreds of dead birds, specifically cormorants, have been washing up all over Martha's Vineyard. The first group that was found was in Edgartown on South Beach. Kate Hoffman is Tisbury's animal control officer. She and her colleagues recovered dozens of the diseased birds on Lambert's Cove Beach in West Tisbury and Aquina Beach as well. Beachgoers need to be on the lookout and to keep your distance. Report them to your local ACO. Um, you know, don't touch them with your bare hands. Um, if there's large amounts, definitely report them to us. The culprit, a strain of highly pathogenic avian flu that originated in poultry. It's now spilling over into wild birds and wild populations worldwide are taking a deadly hit. It, it is absolutely a global virus at this point. Dr. Nicola Hill, a professor of biology at UMass Boston, says we've never seen an avian flu outbreak of this scale in North America. It's already taken a huge toll on the poultry industry. Now seabirds are turning up dead in mass. Conservationists worry protected species are next. We have you know, particular populations in Massachusetts that we really care about, including piping plovers um, and roseate terns and all of these other species that are really on the edge. Avian flu is low risk in terms of transmission to humans, but experts caution you to keep your pets away from the contaminated birds. You're encouraged to report and help them track this outbreak. I think there's a lot that can be done about documenting things from a safe distance with a phone. Yeah, so keep your phone handy. If you see dead birds, take a photo of them and then alert your local animal control officer or mass wildlife.